morning, Kaya. Good morning, my love. How did you sleep? You're so cute. You're so cute. You want to go to the bathroom before you pee on the carpet like you always do? Yeah, let's go to the bathroom because you're going to pee any minute. And that's not going to be on my time. Kaya, sit. Say, Kaya. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Okay. Go potty. Oh, yay! Good girl! Good girl! Yay! You went potty! You went potty! Hiya, say hi! Okay. We're um, potty training her right now, so it's kind of um, cute. She's been um, okay on the leash. Um, so we took her to the mall. She did fantastic. Um, she stayed with us the whole entire time. I didn't have to pull too much. She was just following me. But she's only 10 weeks old. It is very foggy outside. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it is very foggy outside. Like very foggy outside. But it is Monday, so that means meal prepping day. Come on, Kaya. Come on, Kaya. Good girl. Good girl. I'm gonna get started with making a breakfast and I'll show you guys what I do on a weekly base. I seriously, I'm the easy, like, I like foods that don't take that much time to cook. It's all about multitasking, so I'm gonna start with cutting the chicken, doing the Brussels sprouts, doing my beef, and then maybe also prepping my breakfast in the morning. While I'm cooking, I might have some leftover, this like pita sandwich for breakfast because why not? It is amazing. Hey, hello. Do you think you're getting food? Is that what you're thinking? Is that what you're thinking? She's so adorable. I need a little like bag noise. Oh my gosh, let me show you her Grinch toy. Come on, look at this. <laughs> you like it, don't you? Yes, yes. This, this pita bread is literally off the hook. And I think I put too much jalapeno in it because now I can barely eat it. Oh, look at her. She's just so cute. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna start just taking off the fat off the chicken. I wanted to show you something so cute. Okay, so the chicken, the two trays of chickens are here with, um, they're all trimmed. And now I'm just gonna pour a little bit of a chicken stock and then this Stubbs um, barbecue um, sauce in there. And then I'll put that in the crock pot and let it go kind of cook on high for six um, hours. Now I'm gonna start just cutting the ends of these. I just cut the ends first and then just peel the layers and cut them again in half. So, just to make everything easier. I actually don't like eating Brussels sprouts just because um, my body just doesn't digest them really well. But I have noticed that when I cook them a little bit longer, that they actually don't hurt my tummy. So that's what I'm going to do. And Brandon actually knows this really good, well, he actually makes this really good recipe. Um, it's this like bacon Brussels sprout. Oh my gosh, it is to die for. Normally like during the week, we try to eat like as clean as possible. And then on the weekend, we like have our cheat meals and are like, we just treat ourselves. Okay, so I think I'm 
done. So we'll put that there, throw that in here. The only thing that I'm gonna season this with, I do want it to taste good. So um, it's gonna have both, um, sorry, that is not balsamic vinegar, that is olive oil. Um, you wanna make sure that it's extra um, virgin olive oil. Um, and then I'm gonna have some pepper and some sea salt. Remember, it has to be sea salt because sea salt has all the minerals. The other one, the table salt, does not. And then I'm going to drizzle some balsamic vinegar on there. And then just shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it real good. I think this is the last bit that I have, so it's whatever it's going to give me. Perfect. So we're gonna preheat the oven, and while that is preheating, because I that does take a long time, start working on my breakfast quiche slash casserole, whatever you want to call it. I just made it up. I am going to be using a little bit of milk, like maybe one fourth, and tomatoes, egg whites, which is going to be the base of it. I'm gonna have some sausage, and I'm gonna use this. Texas ranch casserole sauce. I try to have veggies in my diet. Um, not like every meal, because I'm really bad at that, but at least one meal. So I'm gonna have it for my dinner and my breakfast. yogurt here um, and I have it for three days so that's like my snack with a little bit of granola and then, then that's my quiche sorry I kind of have a little bit of it um, and I just like basically split it and then I have four ounces of ground beef with um, two ounces of the Brussels sprouts and then of course over here is the chicken that is done and the rice. Hope that helped um, with some ideas of what to do. I always like to change it up for the most part. I don't mind eating some of the same thing for breakfast three days in a row. So I'll change it up next week. But for now, this is what it is. Till next time. Bye. You want to say goodbye? Bye. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Bye.